Hiya and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a BTS related video. BTS related video. <laughs> um, it is going to be about the recent event Bang Bang Con. If you don't know what Bang Bang Con is, I'm going to explain that and give my thoughts about the experience. If you saw Bang Bang Con as well, how was it? It was amazing. If you don't know what Bang Bang Con is, it was a two-day streamed event of BTS concerts on YouTube and it was streaming concerts from back in the day to most recently. So as I said it was two days so um, there's four concerts each day and it was just back to back to back to back. So in total the hours it was a long. Some of the concerts included Red Bullet, um, Wings, Love Yourself. Personally, even though technically this year, um, <clears throat> last week and end of next month, was meant to see BTS touring live their Map of the Soul 7 concert um, live. Uh, yeah, because of COVID, it's not happening at the moment, so especially for people like me who have yet to see them live or who were going to the concert, yeah, like it's a perfect opportunity to at least see what the concert is like live, live, live stream, because obviously this is back in the past, this was like 2015 or 2016, you know, like uh, but the good thing, I suppose, is you can see the growth of not only the concert s stages, but the boys themselves and how much they like grew up as performers, which which is really really cool. That's that's a big plus. I hope that the concert tour will happen this year, but I just don't think so. I mean, I got to stay positive, but. Like, I have to be realistic too, and it hurts to say, but yeah, maybe next year, maybe next year. Like, BTS already did say they're going to work on their next album, and you know, they miss all of us, blah, blah. Um, maybe, maybe, I don't know, because already the South Korea concert that I was meant to go to was cancelled, and the... Uh, the North American one is still postponed, the European one is still postponed, so we don't know. Like, we don't know. <laughs> we don't know how long this thing is going to last, um, how, you know, we just don't know. So, staying positive, staying positive, and it's good that VTS are still, like, producing content for us to see, and also, like, you know, um, live streaming stuff, um, for us to see as well. Uh, recently J-Hope did a TikTok video, mini video, and also Jin is posting videos on Wiverse. Yeah, Wiverse, or Webly, Wiverse. Um, so yeah, they're still active, which is great. But on a little bit of a tangent there. The nostalgia trip for, well, old armies, or armies who actually attended those concerts in the past. Oh my God, I'm so jealous. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a nostalgia trip, not only for BTS, but for armies who are like, oh, they grew up so much as performers. Um, as well as people who are new to BTS, like, it's a way of introducing them, like I said before, it's a way of introducing them to their performers, uh, their performances, what they like, and in between concert clips, they had, um, mini clips of, like, uh, um, BTS bomb all that so like you know it was just content after content which was great and very fulfilling the quarantine at the moment so it's the perfect time to do something like this I mean a lot of performers are like live streaming stuff and doing stuff and keeping people in the loop and stuff um, although you know Bang Bang Con could have changed slightly but I'll get to that in a second um, it was still good. And also, like, 
for the people, and this is a small good, but it's a really good good, is if people bought light sticks um, on the second day, they could have used their light sticks. Unfortunately, mine is still waiting in, I don't know where, but uh, I haven't got mine yet. Still good, but like this, because there could still be improvements, and this is just my opinion, so no stresses. Um, you don't have to agree with me. You can disagree, it's fine. And this is maybe a bias, but they could have, like, you know, spread the concerts out a bit more, like, maybe not two days, but maybe three days or four days, so you have, like, I don't know, like, a concert week rather than two days, because they cram so much in, and it just... It's so hard to pay attention. And I know, like, absolutely, like, I know, dedicated armies will be able to pay attention, but um, a lot of people, unfortunately, I suggest, um, wouldn't be able to stay, like, um, correct me if wrong, obviously, but wouldn't be able to, like, stay focused for that long. Um, I do think they, they should have, yeah, made more, made more, breaks like maybe a morning concert afternoon concert day two morning con anyway that's a thought another thought is not to use youtube next time i know it was a test to use youtube rm tried to test youtube and it crashed but that was live that was literally live streaming but still don't use youtube because the comments wow like the comment section for youtube got like so much that the video started to lag <clears throat> it started to lag there was issues and yeah um and you know people half the comments were like don't comment it's gonna crash the video whereas other people were like oh my god so yeah not youtube not youtube maybe like i don't know what could this v live uh, but that defeats the purpose of being live but still like it could be a special event One last thing is maybe having something extra after now i must admit i didn't see that at the last concert in day two i wanted to but i had work in the morning from what i heard i think they said oh um we'll see you in june or something um so maybe they'll do another online thing um most likely um but maybe yeah maybe they could have had like a you know like bts like Hey guys, thanks for watching this stream, whatever. We'll just share something related to Map of the Soul 7 or maybe perform something. Or... Anyway, it's just a thought. Maybe something did happen and I was just asleep. That's all for this video. I just wanted to sum up, you know, I just wanted to sum up my thoughts on BangBangCon and uh, the future of BTS, sort of, um, in the sense that I do hope I do wholeheartedly hope that at least one concert happens. But you know, we gotta we all gotta stay safe, we all gotta be strong, we all gotta um yeah, not travel yet. So yeah. For the time being, who knows? So just stay strong, um, take care of yourself. Um still support bts obviously and if you don't know who bts is wow please check them out <laughs>